Hi, Nick here from Team Hutchinson Ford. Today we have a 2016 Ford Mustang GT for sale uh, by Team Hutchinson Ford, of course. The colour here is magnetic. This vehicle comes with the personalised plate 2016 GT. Um, to start off, this vehicle is powered by the 5 litre uh, Coyote double overhead cam V8 with uh, aluminium block and heads. It also features twin independent variable camshaft timing and standard. This will produce 306 kilowatts. Um, but as you can see here, we have a Roush cold air induction kit. Uh, we've also got a full performance racing strut brace. Um, some other enhancements have been made to this vehicle. It's got a, um, a full stage two kit, um, but I'll talk about it in just a moment. Uh, as we walk around this vehicle, I'll point out some uh, features as well. So we do have the factory 19 inch um, black alloy wheels, we've got the 5 litre badging and also powered by Ford Racing. Um, this vehicle has a full cat's back exhaust uh, from Ford Performance Racing Parts. I'll just point out quickly as well, there is a 3M style film over um, the front of the bonnet and the front of the car as well. There's a little bit um, round by the mud flaps, sort of just to protect that paint uh, of course. So if we jump on the inside, um, I'll show you straight away we've got this dyno log. So you can see here uh, with these upgrades, so we've got an engine tune. Um, so it's taken from 313 kilowatts at the flywheel to 372. So we've had an engine tune, uh, we've got the cold air induction kit, the cat's back exhaust and that strut brace and the badging all added on with the personalised plate in this package. Um, right here right now having traveled just over a thousand k's as well we've got driver passenger airbags leather interior throughout uh, the front two driver and passenger seats uh, automatic adjustment uh, and then manual adjustment for the backrest see so this is a very nice car in very good condition very hard to find as well especially with the six month waiting list uh, that these mustangs currently have so just put a, a closer look at the Full performance racing exhaust, a lot bigger than the standard one, nice stainless polished tips. Uh, we've got reversing camera and reversing sensors as well. Just show you in the boot. Good amount of space in the boot as well. And the back seats do fold down to give you even more room if required. Um, so we'll jump in, start up the vehicle, and we'll give you a wee, uh, wee listen to the exhaust in idle. Um, the microphone does, it is a little bit noise cancelling, so it won't give you the full no noises um, as if you are here, but it gives you a bit of a better idea. So leather wrap steering wheel, the automatic model here, we've got the paddles behind the steering wheel as well. Um, we'll get to that in just a second. So push button start. And there it is, roars into life. Uh, we know the bonnet is open, that's okay. So you've got ground speed and revolutions per minute, that old retro style uh, that the Mustang has been made famous for. Towards the center we have Ford Sync 2 um, as the infotainment command center. Uh, so we've got phone Bluetooth, uh, GPS navigation, climate control and entertainment all built in. Um, that's the home screen there and that 4 and to go into any of them uh, you can just click on either corner and uh, go straight to that one. So with the audio and climate, uh, you can control it all on screen, uh, all there is, a uh, whole heap of buttons just below. So it is dual zone, so you can change the temperature uh, separately on either side. And the vehicle does have heated or cooled seats uh, as well with three settings on each, which is pretty handy and that's on both sides of course. Uh, so the GPS is nice, easy to use nice and simple. Um, the voice activation you can find locations or points of interest just by talking to the vehicle. Uh, same with the phone um, on Androids. Uh, the car will even read text messages out to you uh, which is pretty handy. So the whole idea is just to take away um, the use of needing to use your hands uh, on dry using your phone. So now you can leave your phone in your pocket the whole time and let the car do all the work. Uh, the selectable driving and steering modes, so we've got these switches here, uh, driving modes, steering modes, traction control and the hazard lights. 
uh, driving modes. I'll scroll through them so you can see normal, sport plus, race track, and snow and wet. Uh, and they sort of uh, explain themselves quite well. Um, so sport will hold the gears, uh, sound a bit louder, stiffen up the steering a little bit. So with the steering as well, I should say, you've got your normal, your sport, and your comfort, and they're pretty self-explanatory as well. You've got your gears, um, drive, in drive, if you're driving along, and you start to use the paddles. After about eight seconds, the car will revert back to itself changing the gears. Uh, however, in sport, if you start using the paddles, the car will stay in that manual mode. Um, so you keep using the paddles um, just like a, like, a, like a race car. Steering controls. Uh, we've got our audio controls, voice activation, phone, Bluetooth, and mute on the right-hand side. We've got our trip computer controls. Uh, so we can go through, have a look at our engine info. So there's a whole heap of um, options here, and you can go into them to get an actual live um, gauge for them as well and then our cruise control just below that so I'll just jump outside quickly and uh, we'll hear this exhaust at idle so you probably won't be able to hear it very well this uh, microphone is a bit noise cancelling um, but if this vehicle is of, is of any interest to you uh, please do not hesitate to give us a call on 0800 buy a Ford uh, or if you'd like to come and view this vehicle in person, Team Hutchinson 4, we're at 186 Churham Street in the central city of Christchurch.